Garrett Griffin is a conference champion wrestler. But our Justin Feld out, Fe Felder found out maybe his greatest accomplishment could have been how the Manoa High School junior handled himself after the championship match. He was just going for it, and I would have done the same thing. Garrett Griffin was leading by a point in the 152-pound Central Wisconsin Championship match last week. The whistle blew for a stoppage. Garrett there on the right. His opponent throws him after the whistle, breaking Garrett's wrist, ending his season. I look at coach, and my hand's like up. And when I look at him, I can't see my hand. I can only see my wrist. And and then I'm motioning him to come over. And then all of a sudden you look and you look at Garrett's eyes and you look at his family's eyes and his teammates and the other coaches and you, you really feel for him. You really feel for him. Garrett stresses this wasn't a dirty move by his opponent, but a desperate one. He needed surgery, a steel plate, and six screws to fix the damage. And once I got in the ER, I was just like, I gotta, I gotta cry this one out, guys. And I just kind of broke down for a while. But uh, after that, I just kind of told myself that... Uh, just worry about tomorrow, you know? You always have the dream of your son winning state and running over, you know, the whole jumping in your arms kind of thing, or the, thanks, Mom. I was more proud of him when he was laying on the mat asking to shake the coach's hand and the other kid's hand and saying, I've never left the mat without doing that, and I'm not going to start today. I just got to work hard for next year because that's all I got. If I just, like, dwell on it, it's just going to, you know, come back to haunt me. and. Next, I still got next year, so this is where it happens. Garrett will be back wrestling next year. This summer, if rehab goes well, all the more motivated and mature after a broken end to a championship.